Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a special, special video for you guys. I'm so excited because I recently got a new palette and I'm really, really excited to use it. And as you can tell by the title, you guys already know what palette it is. And it's the... This palette! It's the 39L Hit The Lights Artistry Palette by Morphe. Guys, I got it and I'm so excited to use it just because the colors are amazing. Like, oh my god. I'm gonna open this for you guys. Look, first of all, we gotta have to look at the the front of this. Look at this. It's gorgeous. My god. Literally, I have like two of the other Morphe's that they launched like wait months back. And I have those two. And I have this one out. And I'm so excited because it's so pretty. And also my favorite YouTuber, um, Bianca, her she did a collaboration with Morphe and with other YouTubers in this palette. So yeah, I'm so excited to use it. So this is how it looks. It looks so pretty. Look at that. So pretty. Okay, now we're gonna open it together. Hold on. Wait, the paper just literally stuck. Okay. And oh, and there you have it. That's the palette. Oh my god, look at this. So, um, this is Bianca Loves Makeup 1. This is her side right here. So, I'm going to take that off. But look at this, guys. Look at those colors. Those are colors are so beautiful. Very, oh my god. These right here, um, these are like highlights right here in the middle. Like highlights. And then these are like, this is Bianca session. This is another YouTuber section. Um, yeah, another YouTuber and then another one and then another one. It's so pretty. Like, my dream, honestly, guys, is to collab with Morphe and make my own palette. Like, honestly, that's like my dream. And I'm like, ugh, really dreaming really hard because I really want a palette of my own. But that's my own personality and everything in it. So, yeah. But this is the palette I'm going to be using for today's video. I'm going to be reviewing it and also doing a look on it with this palette. Super excited about it. Um, but as you guys see, my eyebrows are already done. So how about I just stop talking and just get started with the makeup. Okay, so I'm going to put my little ears on. Because my hair is like all, oh, like I just literally did my hair before this video. Like I straightened it out. So, yeah. If you guys haven't seen my other video with this palette right here. This is the Dominique Cosmetics. Um, minute, um, so was, I can't pronounce that word. But it's this one right here. And my mom got it in her boxy charm. But I have a video on this. If you guys want to go check it out, go check it out. But yeah. Anyway. I love that palette. But anyways, focusing on this palette, the 39 Hit the Lights palette. I'm so excited to use it. Like, oh my god. I don't even know what to do. Honestly, I don't. Like it. But we're gonna do something. We're just gonna wing it and figure something out because this palette is the bomb. God. Oof. When I saw it, they were launching one, and I was like, I had to get it. I had to get it like there was no ifs or buts about it like I literally needed to get it I needed it I, I, I love makeup I don't even get palettes anymore like other from Ulta I don't anymore I usually get like Morphe palettes like new ones that they launch like I get those but nothing else I don't even get BoxyCharm anymore I just deal with the makeup I have like the Morphe palettes I mostly have Morphe palettes that's how, that's how you guys know I love Morphe I love Morphe, but I'm gonna try like their. Con I'm gonna try their foundation, their concealer, and all that stuff. And I might be doing a video on that. Um, I just gotta buy them. So yeah. Oh my god. I kind of put my finger in there. It's fine. Okay. Oh my god. I don't know what to use, you guys. I'm looking at the colors and I'm like, what to use? But you know what? I like Bianca. You know, that's, a, that's one of the YouTubers I do watch. It's Bianca. So, I'm going to use her colors. I'm going to use her colors. Let's see if I can come up with something nice. You know. Okay. So, but I'm actually going to be using another color. Just as the, for the base. Because I want something, you know, 
transition to be nice. So I'm going to be using from, I can't even pronounce this person's name, but their section is called Smoke Show. So I'm going to be using my type as my um, base. So I'm going to pick it up and just put this on my lid. This is literally going to be the base for everything. I literally like to put like, like a, a really like light color because it really helps with the makeup and it blends it really perfectly. So that's why I'm like, yeah. You guys can actually see the color, which is amazing. That's how pigmented this is. It's like, whoa. I'm actually going to be using this little palette mirror because I don't want to be like I, just want, I want you guys to see as much as I, I, I am looking at so but I'm going to do that I really want you guys to see maybe I should put the camera a little bit more closer so you guys can see my eyes hold on okay like that we're gonna do like that okay I think that's better so you guys can see what I'm doing so, um, so I'm putting this color. I'm just putting a little like, amount of it because I really want this transition to be beautiful. Okay, so since we have that on, we have my type on. So now we're going to jump right into... I have to look at these names of these colors. <laughs> we're going to right into um, Hot Stiff. That's like, well... Actually, we're going to do hot stuff after this one. I'm going to put daring. 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 That's what it's called. I'm going to put that. And we're going to put that right in the crease. And just put that right in there. I'm actually winging in this, you guys. I, I didn't plan what I was going to do. I knew that I wanted to use Bianca's side first today. So, that's what I'm doing. But that's the only thing I planned. But, it's okay. I'm just gonna wing it and see what I come up with because these colors are so pigmented like honestly I'm just blend it out these colors are so pretty this kind of like red is really nice this is very good for the holidays like these colors are like perfect for the holidays like honestly Right now we're gonna dump into hot stuff, as I said, and we're gonna put that right between, and then we're gonna just make sure I like. I love red, so I don't have a problem using red today. But it's like my favorite color. Red is my absolutely favorite color. I love my color. So now we're gonna use um the next color in this her in her it's gonna be um serve looks i'm guessing she likes red because she called her section cold red so i'm guessing she likes red and i'm okay with that because i love red too girl i love it too i might be using like the black in this palette because i like smoky eye looks so yeah i might be using from the other section Then we're gonna use the brown. Maybe maybe I'll use the black, I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm gonna use the brown one in this palette in this section. And we're gonna really, really focus on that crease out of the crease. That's the part where we try to smoke it out. Like really smoke it out. You guys can mix these colors up. You don't you don't have to follow the sections like I'm doing. But I really wanted to use Bianca's today. It's a tribute to Bianca because I really like her makeup. She's amazing and talented. And I'm really trying to like be like her, like Candy Lover and her and so many YouTubers out there that I look up to. So yeah. But so far I really like her section. You guys can mix these colors up if you want. Don't have to be doing what I'm doing, but I like it. Okay, so since we have that down, I'm going to be doing a cut crease. 
I don't know if I should put black. I don't know if that's gonna look nice. Maybe I could put like a very tiny like pat into it. Maybe I'll do that. But I'm gonna use it from from this person's palette. It's called After Party by Vic Ram. That's his name. It's called Till Dawn. I'm gonna use that a little bit from your palette. Oh my god, I just took a little bit and I literally darkened that. Wow. Okay, so I'm gonna go this very slowly. Not hard. Very slowly. So I can really darken that brown up a little bit. I'm doing it very slowly. I'm not really putting pressure on it. On the brush. At all. So I'm doing like that. Slowly. I'm barely touching my crease right now. That's how I'm doing this. Barely touching it. Just so I can darken that brown a little bit. You know what I mean? Okay. So since I darkened it a little bit, I'm going to take out this tape because I this helps me with my, you know, I don't have a steady hand. So this actually really helps me a lot. So I'm going to grab like a little spongy thing right here. Spongy right here. Then my makeup remover. And put a little bit in there. And then I'm going to just literally clean this up. A lot of fallout came out, so you know, we're gonna clean that up, make sure it's like all oh, good in there. So, I'm gonna do my cut crease, you guys. So, I'll be right back once that cut crease is done. Okay, so, my cut crease are done. Um, I actually did, I actually like the way I did it this time. Uh, I just wanna fix right here. If you guys don't know, if you guys are new to my channel, um, there's one thing that I hate with my makeup sometimes. Um, it's like one eye is better than the other. That's like the only thing that's annoying. But, you know, we ain't perfect, so, you know. But anyway, I'm going to grab a flat brush. I'm going to dip right into, I don't even know what color to use. This one's very pretty. This one right here, I don't know if you guys can see it, but that's a pretty shade right there. Um, there's a lot, so many shades that I want to use for this palette, for this color. Oh my god, that's a great one. Ooh. And this is not from Bianca's section. This is from another section. That gold is beautiful. I might use this gold. I'm sorry. Okay, I gotta use it. I use Bianca's color. I'm gonna use Flirt Alert in this palette. Oh my god. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. I have to. Okay. So I'm using Bianca and a little bit of other people's colors. So. Um. I love it. Oh my god. It's so cool. It's like gorgeous. I'm trying to pick some up though. Come on. Get on my brush. Okay, I'll pick some up. And I'm literally put that right on there. <gasps> Look at that. That's pretty. Okay. I'm trying to like really like focus. I'm going to put this on because it's like very pigmented. So I'm really trying to focus right now. But I'm literally gonna pat it on slowly until I get this into my crease. Really pretty color. This is a really, really great gold color. I really love it. I had to use it. Bianca's shimmers are beautiful as well. But for some reason, this really like spoke to me and I really wanted to put it on. I really love it though. Everybody did an amazing job in this palette. The colors that they, they chose, beautiful. It's like my ultimate dream, you guys, to make my own palette. Literally. I'm trying to put this on nicely because it's not going on nicely. It's like I'm trying to shape my crease, but it's not working. It's fine. We can just fix that. We'll fix this. I told you, one eye is better than the other. I'm telling you that, guys. It's literally insane. It feels like I'm tipping into jello. That's how it feels when I, my brush feels when I put, try to pick this thing up. It feels like jello. It 
but it's like getting on e so easily which I adore I'm really trying to get these edges on my crease oh a fallout came out I scared me okay um I'm really trying to like really put this on it's like I'm really trying to put this on like literally I don't know why my brush was bad but I'm really hard to put this on okay so what I'm gonna do to fix this I'm gonna put some glitter on my crease so I can use to fix it a little bit I hope you guys can see because I really can't Okay, so I put some gold. Maybe that will help a little bit. I know you guys can see in the camera. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You guys can see. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. So I put some glitter. Maybe to like really like. I'm trying to make this like too dry because if I blink, it's gonna really mess up the makeup. I'm gonna be so mad. Okay, so I'm not trying to blink, but I'm going to put some tape because i got to fix this side right here. i got to fix this side. And I'm going to put some of the brown that I did before, and I'll put it right there to fix that up a little bit. Since it's like literally going away, I don't know why, but it is. Okay, so I put that on to this off now. I fixed it because it was like fading away. Okay, so I'm trying not to blink. I really want this to dry. So once it's finished drying, I'll come back you guys. So my eyes, they dried. Um, this camera's so close up. Okay, but I put, I, when I'm my, like, blah, 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 I can't talk. I put like a little bit more black just because um, I really want this to be like a smoky eye look, you know? So that's what I did. Um, I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna put some eyelashes now. Sorry. Okay, so I'm gonna put some lashes now. I don't know what lashes I'm going to use. Um,. But I'm going to use these ones right here. These are my favorite ones. So, um, I'm going to use those. I'm still waiting for my other lashes to come in. So, I'm going to use this one for now. I'm just getting my stuff ready to put my lashes on. I'm actually going to put my lashes on camera. So you guys can know, like, how to see how I did it. I know some people are still trying to learn how to put lashes on. So that's why I'm going to be doing it on camera for you guys. So... So I'm going to put some mascara first. You always put mascara on first. It's the first thing you do before you put your lashes on. You have to put mascara first. And basically you're getting them primed. That's basically what it means. So. Okay. Um, okay. So since we did that, I'm going to grab my lash. My lash is here. It's already like... Um, fit it on me like I, I measured it already so that's the thing you always gotta do first too you have to make sure it's measured make sure it's not too long make sure you're comfortable with this like basically the length of it and this is my length and it's like, I like it it doesn't bother so what do you do honestly sorry I'm gonna try to like see the camera and try to put this on so what you do is you actually grab the lash you put it in the middle oh my god got stuck to my finger that's the one thing i hate when you get stuck to my finger all right so you put it in the middle hold on in the middle once you have it in the middle you grab it on the sides You grab it on the sides 
make sure it's like sticking to you and not to the tweezers. I'm sorry, my nose is itching. I'm sorry. Okay, so I, I'm gonna try to grab it again. For some reason, this is not gonna go. But again, okay, come on. I'm doing this on camera, guys. Let's go. Mira, esta cosa me no, no quiere entrar. Okay, I think I got it. But yeah, you always do middle first. That's the first thing you do. You do the middle, and um, it kind of went worked a little bit. You know, it worked. But you always do the middle first. So I got that one. I got one eye on. See how long is it? It's so pretty. Okay, so you got the other one. You put glue, I put duo glue, my duo glue is my favorite. Okay, so then you grab the other one, you literally put it towards the middle. I put it on the middle, and so I touch it, and then you put the sides. So, oh my god. I get stuck to my tweezers. Here when that happens. Okay, middle again. I'm sorry, you guys. It's not working out. I'm gonna do it with other tweezers. You just, you, so you can use your fingers too. You don't have to use tweezers. But um, I feel like tweezers are easier for me. Okay, so then I grab the end of the tweezer and I literally push it down. Literally, I push it. Okay, so that's on. My lashes on. Finally. It was a very, very headache. But um, what I noticed when I was putting my lash on, my gold was coming out a little bit. I don't know why, but I will put some back. I actually grab a brush and just put it back. Because it was like, I don't know why it's coming off, but it is. So I put some back like that. Put it back. Okay, so my lashes are on. They're on. They look so cute. They're so they're cute, adorable. Okay, so then I grab my mascara curler. Mascara curler. My eyelash curler and I curl my real lashes with my fake ones. Just don't pinch yourself. The only thing it gets stuck and it's annoying. But it helps. And I squeeze it together. Make sure it doesn't come off though. That's what we When it starts to come off, that's like when it's really annoying. Because then you have to like fix it and re glue it, and it's annoying. I'm gonna like literally fix this again because it's coming off. This glitter really comes off like easily though. I'm not gonna lie. That's one thing about it. It's gonna be like uh, annoying, but overall it's beautiful still. So making sure my lashes are on. Okay, my lashes are on. Okay, so then I grab my mascara and I literally go like that to give it like more volume than it already has because I really like them when they had a lot of volume on it. I like when they touch my eyebrows. Okay, my eyebrows. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do is grab um, my waterline pencil and I'm gonna put this on the bottom of the waterline. Okay, so mine's are basically done. Now I'm gonna do her face. So now I'll put the camera back the way it was before because you know now I gave them my face and yeah. So um I already had this it's so pretty, look at that, look at that, it's so gorgeous. Ooh, it's like very it's like a glamorous look, but then it's very subtle, you know. Which I like. I like that a lot. Okay, so 
since I have them done, I'm actually going to start doing my face now. And I'm going to just grab the stuff that I need and take it out so I can have them ready, you know. But, um, yeah, there we go. Okay, so now I'm going to put my Too Faced primer on. And we're going to literally put this on my head. My, my face is very glittery right now. It has a lot of glitter. It's okay. The foundation is going to make that go away. See, I like glitter, but I don't like it when it's on my skin. If that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, Monica, you have glitter on your eye. I know that, but I don't like it when it's on my like my face like like on my cheeks and all that stuff it's really weird i'm weird for makeup so i'm putting this on probably my face it smells so good oh my god it smells so good okay then since we have that done now i'm gonna jump into my foundation and i'm going to grab my grab it right here and just enjoy it fast mode <laughs> like I always do and yeah Okay, since that's done, I'm actually going to grab my, my Morphe spray. Okay. Oof. A lot. I'm going to use my highlight brush. And, hmm. Sorry. Okay. I'll do that next time. Okay. Um, I really like this gold one. I don't know. This one's really pretty too. I don't know what to decide, guys. Okay. So many options. That's the thing. Oh my god. Wait. It's beautiful too. Okay. I'm going to use this gold one. Just because, um, actually, before I do that, I'm going to spray a little bit. I always spray my brush. Okay. So I'm going to grab the gold. Yo! Oh my god! Yo, this silent is gorgeous! Oh my god, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't. This is to die for. What the? Do you see that glow? Can you guys see it? Well, damn. Okay, like, shoot. They wanted us to glow, and we glowing. Put some on my lip, and then here. Put some here a little bit on my nose. The thing is, like, it's very, very, like, glitterly. Glitter. Like, a lot of glitter. And that's the only thing, but it's really gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie. I'm just, like, making sure this is, like, all blended out perfectly. Yeah. 
Whoa. Okay. Anywho, sorry about that moment. I was having a moment. Okay, so I'm gonna put some of my lip do do me up for my lips. I basically prime my lips with this. Oh, okay. well, I use like blue sticks too, but I like how this feels on my lips. It's so smooth. You know what I mean? Okay, so I'm seeing. Okay, now we're gonna use. Um, <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> so we're gonna be using a. Anastasia Beverly Hills or maybe actually we're gonna use this this is the live glam uh, this is um I do it's called I do and let's see how this looks I want something to look nice with this makeup look Wow, but like I literally just put like one and it literally came out so much. And I use my finger to literally like dab it and dab it into my lips. That's what I always do. It's so pinky. I love it. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think I should use like a lighter shade? I wish you guys can talk to me and <laughs> answer me. Okay guys, so this is the end of my makeup makeup tutorial for today. Sorry, I'm like trying not to talk too fast. But um, but yeah, this is the final look. Um, I just need to add something real quick that I didn't add before. Um, I added my earrings. I got them so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna add um, I'm gonna add the colors I used before, which is severe looks and for real. I'm gonna put that under my eyes my eye because i didn't put it on and i'm gonna put it right here i'm gonna put that under i really want that smoky look so i'm gonna make sure i put that under there we go and then i'm gonna grab some, the other color i mentioned and just mix it in in there Try to mix it in but there you go i added that because i wanted to add that i was like wait i didn't get to finish my eyes so um but yeah this is the final makeup tutorial um and makeup look for today's video um i'm really really happy how it turned out like the colors blended so beautifully like you guys it was so beautiful like i was like wow really really beautiful colors so this palette is to die for to die for the best holiday gift you can receive from anyone if you're a makeup artist and i didn't recommend you to get this palette this palette is amazing so pigmented worth the price actually i use bianca's um code and i got it you know i think 10 20 or 10 percent off of this and yeah but i just love the colors the colors are so beautiful so pretty look at that Bianca's colors are amazing. I am using her colors and I'm using one of the other um, YouTubers um, colors on here as well. I used the, the black one. But um, I just love how it looks. It looks gorgeous. Amazing, amazing palette. I'm like so happy that I got it because I, I was dying for it. I was like, I had to get it. Like once I heard about it and it was gonna, they were going to launch it, I was like, I must have it. I have to have it. I have to. Like it's a must. So I got it and I'm so happy to do more looks for you guys with this palette. So stay tuned for that. Um, also for my lips, I did change the color. I took it off. I actually used my two Kylie ones. I used um, Ulta Beauty and Savage. I put it together and I made this and it's so cute. So yeah, those are the two colors I used for my lips because I did change the other one. It was too dark for me for this look, particular look. So I was like, nah, no. So, but at least at the end of our video i'm really happy how they really made this palette this palette is beautiful they did an amazing job with all the colors i congrats all of them on their amazing work here putting this palette together and this is my dream like one day hopefully i i can make my own palette with morphe 
because Morphe is everything to me. I love them so much. I have so much Morphe palettes, like Morphe brushes, like it's to die for. I can't wait to get Morphe um, foundation and the concealer and the powder and all that because I do want to make a video based on Morphe, you know, to reviewing Morphe to see how it is because I do use Ulta Beauty um, other products from Ulta Beauty like um, the Verde K foundation, the Too Faced Sun foundation, um, Becca and all that all the beautiful products in that store so yeah uh, I really want to like, expand more and experiment more with makeup so hopefully in the future I will do that because the money is tight right now so I have to just work with what I have but hopefully I'll do a video on Morphe and just on Morphe so yeah stay tuned for that soon 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 you guys will you guys will know soon but don't forget to like don't forget to like <laughs> pause don't forget to subscribe, like, and I did it wrong. Whoa, wait, time out again. Pause, hold on. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can be notified when I post another video like this one. There we go, there we go. I messed up a little bit. I used it backwards for a second. I don't know why. But with that being said, guys, hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I did filming it for you guys. I really had fun with these colors, um, creating a look like this. I'm so happy how it turned out. Um, no cons about this palette at all. I really like this palette. But I guess one little con is like one of the shimmers kept like coming off. Like I had to reapply it like three times. I don't know why that happened, but that's the only thing. But everything else is so beautifully, so pigmented. It's just, oh, I love it. So, but um, I love you guys so, so much. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, babes.